All right, everyone, we are on our reading part. So you should be on your Unit 8 magazine. And our story today is The Night Sky on page 8. Let's go ahead and open up to page 8, The Night Sky. We're going to read this one together once, and then we'll read through it again and find those bossy R words. Okay? So here we go. The Night Sky. Sky. And remember, oh, this is from last week, our I sound. I-G-H says I. The night. Oh, and there, sky. Oh, that's from last week. What a good connection. All right, here we go. The sky puts on a show at night. The stars twinkle like diamonds. And remember, when there are long words like this, you can chunk it out. So, d i m Uns, diamonds. The moon reflects the sun's light and looks bright in the sky. It's a great show for you and me. This is a lot of long I words. Wow. I wonder if we're going to have any AR words. All right, let's keep going. Each night, long I again, each night the moon seems to change a little. At times, it looks large and round, like this. We call that a full moon. At times, it looks like a thin slice, right here. We call that a crescent moon. I don't know if I'm hearing any R words yet. I hear a lot of long I words. Let's keep reading and keep looking. Is there a man in the moon? No, there isn't. The moon has dark and light parts. These parts can look like a man's face. Ooh, do you see a face? Maybe there, two eyes and a big smile. Maybe. The stars put on a bright show too. You can connect some stars to make shapes in the sky. One shape looks like a big pan. We call it the Big Dipper. Maybe you will see it tonight. Have fun at the show. All right, we're gonna read it through one more time and circle the words we can find with R. I didn't hear very many, maybe a couple. So let's see what we can find. Lots of long I, so that's good practice from last week. Let's read again, all about the night sky. Really quickly, do you think this is a fiction story or a non-fiction? Fiction means fake, remember. Does this look like it's fake or is this real? Yep, this is real pictures of something that's really on our earth. Houses are real, boys are real, telescopes are real, the moon is real, stars are real. So it's all real, so we would call it non-fiction. So it's a true, giving us facts about the sky. All right, let's read again. Read with me, put your finger there and let's read together. The sky puts on a show at night. The stars twinkle like diamonds. The moon reflects the sun's light and looks bright in the sky. It's a great show for you and me. Do we see any R words? Oh, I see one, stars. I don't know if I see any more. A lot of long I, but I don't see any R. Let's keep going. Each night, the moon seems to change a little. At times, it looks large and round. Large, R. We call that a full moon, right here. At times, it looks like a thin slice. We call that a crescent moon. So we have large. Do we see anything else? I don't think so. This one does not have very many R words. Is there a man in the moon? No, there isn't. The moon has dark, <gasps> Arr, dark and light parts. These parts, oh, I'm supposed to be circling. I was not following directions. I was just underlining our R's. Dark and light parts. <gasps> P 
parts. These parts can look like a man's face. And that's the different dark and light parts of the moon. The stars, stars, put on a bright show too. You can connect some stars arr, to make shapes in the sky. One shape looks like a big pan. We call it the Big Dipper. Maybe you will see it tonight. Have fun at the show. Oh, that makes me want to go outside and look at stars. All right, great job. If you want to, you can do some extra practice some other time and write about the sun, the stars, and the moon. Um, but right now, we are done with our reading time, and we're going to go to math. So Batman will see you at math time. Good job.